And then a couple minutes in, I just had a panic attack and it was really bad. <sighs> and I was up on stage and I took my shirt off to try to be funny or something. <laughs> I don't know. Blast like active against black. man. Yeah, exactly. Well, are, you, you want to hear my weird and, early experience in comedy? Yes. Let's do okay. it. So I moved to San Francisco in the late, eight, like 86, 87. And there was a, a club there called The Other Cafe. And that was walking distance from my house. So I get, I, I'm able to sign up for like showcase night kind of thing. But in those days, it's like, there were real names. So the other comics there, just to drop a couple names, were like Carlos Alizraki was there, um, uh, Bobby Slayton, th these kind of people. Who, who else was at that show? Um, uh, uh, Rob Schneider, right? I didn't know these guys. I was, because this, this was like my second or third time on stage. And I had no idea what would be funny for material. So don't ask me why I thought this would be funny, but... I thought if I took out a raw egg and threw it up in the air and tried to catch it in my mouth, it would be a great way to start the act. Because I figure if I caught it, it would be impressive. And if it broke, I would have egg on my face and people would laugh. <laughs> that is as far as I thought this through. So they play the introduction music. I walk on stage on my like, ladies and gentlemen, drum roll. It starts, I throw up the egg. I had not considered a third option, which is the egg hit my lip right here and split it wide open. Oh, fuck. <laughs> and yeah. blood shot out onto the audience in the front row. And in the late 80s, at the height of the AIDS scare in San Francisco, the last thing people wanted was a stranger's blood projectile, just projecting out right onto their clothing. Oh my God, that's some, uh, that's some, oh God. AIDS Gallagher shit. <laughs> like weird Gallagher shit. Like, so I put my finger to my lip because I didn't feel it at first, but I'm like, I, I, I was like, there's a really weird horrified look on these people's faces. And then I felt like this warm trickling and I go like this and I just remember going, oh, this is bad. I should go, <laughs> right? And then there was a moment of silence and then they started the exit music <laughs> oh, <laughs> i just <dear>. left <laughs> and for a while i was kind of known as the blood guy <laughs> like, like so i there was no real rush to get me back on an open mic stage <laughs> oh my god huh yeah oh, yeah and this is my, my buddy my... Gus's favorite story. Like he has probably heard that like six times. And if we get together, he's like, tell me the egg story. 